indeed to race to the first of the eight flights. Welcome pin. Cassan towards the left of the picture with the sheepskin noseband between them. Tele Trader right up with them and, and uh, a faller there. And the faller, it's Celtic Shot. Celtic Shot has gone at the first and has brought down Au Revoir Jones, so two of them out of it. Neither jockey to rise, but both horses continuing riderless. And now it's Cuddy Dale and Miss G Armitage bidding to be the first uh, woman to ride a winner over hurdles at the National Hunt Festival in the lead, but being carried out by the loose horse. She's carried right out. Cuddy Dale is carried right out, and he's out of it. He's going to have to be pulled up. Welcome Pin is left in the lead from protection over on the far side. Then comes Special Vintage. Behind them comes... Mr. Parker, behind Mr. Parker is High Plains, and then comes Hill Pageant and Cassan, and then Smith Gamble and Telly Trader and Black Sand, with Outrider on the inside, and Tartan Taylor next, followed by Have Faith. Then comes Fourth Tudor and Christian Shad, and Officer's Mess, and the back marker is Biloxi Blues. So three of them are out of it. Both riders are up all right. G Armitage uh, is all right too, but three of them are out of it as they run down the hill. It's welcome pin for Ireland from Protection for England. Then on the outside, Mr. Parker, Special Vintage and High Plains next, followed by Hills Pageant, and then comes Smith's Gamble. Kassan on the outside. As they jump the third, welcome pin. Jumps it clear of protection. Kassan on the outside with Mr. Parker. Right up with them, Special Vintage and Hills Pageant and High Plains on the inside. Then comes Black Sand and Tele Trader and Outrider. Biloxi Blues is still the back marker and Welcome Pin and Tommy Comedy making it as they come down to the fourth of the eight flights. Welcome Pin lands in the lead. Kassan improves on the outside. Protection holds his place on the inner. Mr. Parker close in fourth with just behind him Black Sand. Special Vintage right up with them too and Hills Pageant but Welcome Pin with the advantage as they come to the next. This is the fifth. Welcome Pin lands in the lead from protection on the inside of Special Vintage. Cassan on the outside. Hills Pageant right up with them. A gap then to Black Sand and Tele Trader as they race towards the top of the hill. Welcome Pin with the advantage. Three left to jump from Cassan and Hills Pageant. Then comes Protection and special vintage matching strides. Running down now towards the next, it's welcome pin for Ireland from Kassan for Ireland. Just in behind them, Hills Pattern and special vintage, protection on the inside. Three from home, welcome pin landed in the lead. Welcome pin, Tommy Carmody from John Short, riding at Cheltenham for the first time in second place on Kassan. Then comes protection in third now, then special vintage and Hills Pageant as they jump the second last. And Kassan and Welcome Pin almost together there. Improving on the outside is Officer's Mess. Kassan has taken a fractional advantage now as they run the home turn. Outrider is coming there strongly too. It's Kassan being pressed now by Officer's Mess. Outrider, Hills Pageant, Welcome Pin. Protection under pressure over on the far side. Tartan Taylor coming there strongly too. Hills Pageant, Tartan Taylor, Tartan Taylor and Hills Pageant. The little between them as they race into the closing stages. It's Tartan Taylor and Hills Pageant as they race up towards the line. Tartan Taylor has it from Hills Pageant without Ryder finishing strongly. Tartan Taylor as they race to the line is going to run it. Tartan Taylor has won it from Hills Pageant second. Out Ryder is third and fourth was half faith. So the result of the Waterford Crystal Supreme Novices Hurdle of 1987. First number 28, Tartan Taylor owned by the Edinburgh Woolen Mill Limited, trained by Gordon Richards at Penrith and written by Phil Tuck. Second was number 13, Hills Pageant, owned by Mr. Basil Thwaites, trained by Fulk Warwin and written by Kevin Mooney. And third was number 20, Outrider, owned by Mrs. Shani Morris, trained by Mouse Morris and written by Niall Madden. And officially, it's a photograph for fourth place, a photogra photograph between Have Faith and High Plains, but no doubt that Gordon Richard Stable has struck number one blow in this war.